An American man's $8 million bequest to a South Australian wombat conservation group has been challenged by the man's family. The Wombat Awareness Organisation near Manham had hoped to use some of the bequest to treat a mysterious wombat skin disease, but those plans have now been cast into doubt. No one's quite sure how many southern hairy-nosed wombats call Australia home. The last time they were counted was in 1989. In many parts of South Australia, the species is under threat. One concern is a recently discovered skin disease, affecting populations in the Murraylands. Treatment costs $1,000 per wombat, and one organisation was banking on a large donation to pay for it. The bequest originally was for $8 million, and they are going to give us a um, $1 million each year in, for eight years. But five members of the donor's family are now contesting his gift in an American court. Bridget Stevens says she can't afford to put up a fight. We could be taking in 10, 20, 100 wombats a day that we're finding that are dying, but there's simply not the funds there to be able to support um, not just the veterinary work, but also the care for them. University of Adelaide conservationists are now looking into the mysterious condition. The Adelaide Zoo is also studying other threats to the species. Land clearance is a big one, and also things like uh, roadkill is a problem and disease such as mange. The findings of both studies will be available soon. Stephen Smiley, ABC News, Adelaide.